the book that I have chosen to do has to be read aloud. Um, I'm not going to show my regularly handsome face at this point, but I am going to extend to you and show you the warning that comes on this book. It says, this book looks serious, but it actually is completely ridiculous. If a kid is trying to make you read this book, the kid is playing a trick on you. You will end up saying silly things and making everybody laugh and laugh. Don't say, I didn't warn you. <clears throat> the book is with no pictures. The book with no pictures by B.J. Novak. Put together by Dial Books. And it starts out really with no pictures. This is a book with no pictures. Sorry for the fuzziness. It might seem like no fun to have someone read you a book with no pictures. It probably seems boring and serious, except here's how books work. Everything the words say, the person reading the book has to say, no matter what. That's the deal. That's the rule. So that means even if the words say, blork, wait, what? That doesn't even mean anything. Blurf! Wait a second, what? That isn't the kind of book I want to read, and I have to say every word the book says. Uh-oh. I am a monkey who taught myself to read. Hey, I'm not a monkey. And now I'm reading you this book with my monkey mouth and my monkey voice. That's not true. I am not a monkey. Yes, I'm a monkey. And also, I am a monkey robot. Robot monkey, excuse me. What? And my head is made of blueberry pizza. Wait a second. And the book goes on and on. And now it's time. This is one of my favorites. Now it's time for you, for me to sing you my favorite song. A song? Do I really have to sing a... Glug, glug, glug. My face is a bug. I eat ants for breakfast. Right off the rug. What? This book is ridiculous. Can I stop reading yet? No. There are more pages. I have to read the rest. My only friend in the whole wide world is a hippo named Boo Boo Butt. Boo Boo Butt? And also the kid I'm reading this book to is the best kid ever in the history of the entire world. Oh really? And this kid is the smartest kid too because this kid chose this book even though it had no pictures. Because kids know this is the book that makes grown ups have to say silly things. And make silly sounds like oh no. Here it comes. And then, glurp, guaco, Mr. Grump. I, I, this is my personal favorite. Eee! Sounds like my two year old grandson. Badoongy face. That's a new one. Hadn't heard that one. Oh my goodness. Please don't ever make me read this book again. It is so silly. In fact, it is completely and utterly preposterous. Now, that's a big word for small children, but they will never forget that word. Next time, please, 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 please choose a book with pictures, please, because this is just too ridiculous to read. The end. Bonk. I didn't want to say that. And as my last hurrah, boo-boo butt.